guys welcome back to another video hope you all are doing well all right i want to thank almighty god for another bright and beautiful day today guys i will be showing you all how to make an amazing air growth butter for air moisturizing scalp stimulation fighting or split air stop of air breakage and also moisturize and hydrate your air and help your air to grow healthy and strong from your scalp so i will go in with my five organic carrots i've washed and defect them but i'm still going to peel out the skin as you can see me doing and i also want to thank all my amazing viewers thank you so much for your constant love and your support and if you are new here welcome my name is jenny i'm into skin and air growth tips so if you find this video useful and you feel like you want to see more of me then support your girl by giving this video a thumbs up so after peeling my carrot i'm going to cut the top and the bottom part of it as you can see me doing the after that guys i will show you guys what and what i'll be doing next So after cutting my carrot, I will go in with my grater to grate my carrot. I use both sides in grating my carrot. But if you don't want to grate your carrot, you can as well cut it into a dice form. But me, I love to grate my carrot because this is how I get all the amazing nutrients from the carrots. So after grating my carrots, this is how my carrots are looking right now. They look so yummy like I want to eat them. <laughs> I'm telling you guys. The one I will need, I will need my fresh, the fruits, aloe vera plant. So if you want to see how I cut and preserve my aloe vera, I'm going to link it down below so that you can get your fresh aloe vera plant. They can just preserve views. And trust me guys, when you take your aloe vera out of your freezer, it's still going to look fresh and all the nutrients will be there waiting for you so as you can see me doing i'm just cutting my aloe vera into a dice form as you can see me doing right now so lovely is i finished cutting my aloe vera as you can see aloe vera is amazing on your hair and your scalp is straightening your hair as antibacterial and also give your hair an amazing moisture then my next ingredient will be my fenugreek seed if you don't have this one you can use the fenugreek powder so i will go in with three spoon of my fenugreek seed as you can see me doing right now Fenugreek has an amazing benefit. It stimulates your scalp, moisturizes your hair, has antibacterial, fights down drop, and gives your hair shine. The next thing I will need, I will need my fresh rosemary plant. Rosemary also stimulates your scalp. It has antibacterial as well, moisturizes your hair, straightening your hair follicles. So I'm going to throw that amount into my bowl. Then I will go in with my mint leaf. Mint has an amazing smell, guys, and also it stimulates your scalp and moisturizes your hair and fight against dandruff and split end so i will go in with that amount over here i have my sunflower oil i will go in with 100 ml of my sunflower oil sunflower oil moisturizes your hair as antibacterial and also gives your hair shine then i will go in with 50 ml of my extra virgin olive oil extra virgin olive oil moisturizes your hair softening your hair and also stimulate your scalp then i will go in right now with my grape seed oil grape seed oil moisturizes your hair give your hair shine as well then after that i will go in with my coconut oil we all know the amazing benefit of my coconut oil coconut oil is amazing on your hair and your scalp as well so i will go in with 50 ml of my coconut oil as you can see me doing So lovely, my next ingredient is my 100% castor oil. Castor oil moisturizes your hair, stimulates your scalp, and also strengthen your hair and help your hair to grow extremely well. All the link of all these ingredients, I will put them down below. In case you want to purchase them, you can easily find them on Amazon. So check out the link down below in the description box. So as you can see right now, I'm just tearing all the ingredients together. Guys, when making yours, please make sure you 
mix all the ingredients together before you transfer them into your pot because you want them to saturate together to bring out all the nutrients because you are making this remedy this ingredient this recipe <laughs> To get all the amazing benefits so after stirring all my mixtures together i am going to to transfer it into my little pot as you can see me doing so lovelies right now i am going to transfer my pot into my flame guys you want to cook on a very low heat as you can see my flame is so low and this is how you want to cook your ingredients don't over process it so that you will not lose all the nutrients and please don't cook your ingredient on a high flame i cooked mine for 40 minutes as you can see right now is boiling and bringing out all the amazing nutrients and trust me guys i cooked mine for 40 minutes on a very 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 low flame so i will advise you when cooking yours don't overcook yours and don't cook yours on the high flame not to over process the nutrients so lovelies after 40 minutes i've cooled my ingredients down a little even though it's still hot so i'm going to transfer it into my filter that i'm going to press all the oil out of it you want to press all the oil as many as you can get i see i have some little or no water in there but don't worry we are still going to press and press and press so after pressing these are the amount of my oil i got from my ingredients So now time for the butter. I will go with my cacao butter. I will go with 30 grams of my cacao butter. Guys, any oil you have, any butter you have, just get the main ingredient, which are the carrot, the aloe vera, and the leaves. And uh, any butter, any oil of your choice, I will advise use any one you have. Then I will go in with my shea butter, my own refined shea butter. Then I will go in with 40 grams of my shea butter, as you can see. Then I'm gonna transfer it into so my oil my oil is still kind of hot okay the oil is going to melt the butter then i will go in with my palm butter i will go in with 30 grams as well of my palm butter as you can see me do Then my next butter will be my mango butter. I will need a little pinch of my mango butter. I will go in with 10 grams of my mango butter. I love mango butter a lot. Then after that, I will go in with 2 spoons of my pure organic honey. Guys, always make sure you incorporate honey into your hair routine. Honey is amazing on your hair strand. Then after that, I will go in with my emulsifying wax, only derived. I will go in with 20 grams of my emulsifier. When making any product, any cream on water base, Always make sure you apply your emulsifier. So right now, I will just transfer it into my bowl as you can see me doing. Then the next thing I will need is my glycerin vegetable oil. I will go in with 40 grams of my vegetable oil into my bowl as you can see me doing for moisturizing and hydrating your hair. Then I will go in with, 10, with 1 spoon of my argan oil. Argan oil is amazing, softening your hair and moisturizes your hair. I will go in with 1 spoon. Then after that, I am going to stir up. All my ingredients together so like i say guys any butter of your choice any oil of your choice you are good to go okay you must not go any extreme to make yours like the way i'm making mine okay this is how i love to make mine but if you don't have all the ingredients please don't over stress yourself so after stirring look at how my ingredients are looking they have become this liquid form so then right now i'm going to cover it up to put it into my deep freezer for up to 20 minutes yes i love to cover the or because i don't want more water into the mixture into the butter so i need to cover it up and allow it to solidify a little bit for 30 minutes then after 30 minutes guys look at how my butter are looking my cream is looking it's not that uh, concentrated it's not that hard it's not that strong but i love this consistency like this then i'll go in with my mixer to mix it up as you can see i'll just stir it up a little bit then after that guys i'll show you guys what i'll be doing next
so lovely is after mixing for some minutes look at how the color is looking the color has changed guys then after that i will go in with my spatula to just scoop all the excess butter in the in the mixer then i will scoop around my bowl as you can see me doing Then after scooping, I am going to cover it up again and I will allow it to solidify into my freezer for up to 20 minutes. Then after 20 minutes, look at how my, my cream is looking. Look at how solidify is looking and it's the perfect way I want it to be like, okay? Then after that, I am going to mix it together. This process is all about mixing, scooping, mixing, scooping as you can see me doing. So lovelies, after mixing, I will go in with my spatula to scoop the excess cream out of my mixer. You want to mix and scoop, mix and scoop because you want everything to really, really come out of fluffy and you want all it to mix together. So as you can see, I'm just mixing, I don't scoop it the whole side of my bowl. Then after that guys, I will go in with my essential oils. I will go in with my lemongrass essential oils. I will go in with 10 drops of this particular essential oils any one you have just use the one you have then i will go in with my calyptus essential oil i will go in with 10 drop as well of my calyptus essential oil then i will go in with my sweet orange essential oil then i'm going to apply 10 drop of my sweet orange essential oil then after that i am going to miss again So lovelies, after mixing, this is how my cream is looking, looking so fluffy, looking so moisturized, looking so smooth, and looking so beautiful, as you can see. Then after then, I will go in with my sterilized jar. Please, when preserving yours, preserve on a sterilized jar. You can apply your preservative as well, because me, I don't apply any one to my, I just store my inside my fridge, okay? See, I consume them, because I I use this one for my hair and that of my children hair and also I give out to some friends. So lovely, here is the final look of my hair growth moisturizing butter to double your hair growth. Use twice weekly to moisturize your hair and trust me, you are going to see amazing results. And if you like it, please give me the thumbs up and leave me any questions down below. All the ingredients, I will put the link down below once again. And thank you all for watching. Until I will see you in the next one or until you see me on your screen next time, I remain blessed. I know what peace. Bye-bye.